what I saw with LinkedIn was a confluence of, of, of a technology trend and a uh, how the whole world is changing trend. And the way the world is changing, which is kind of the more interesting deep one, is that uh, every individual is now a business of themselves. And then, oh, you have this thing called the internet, <laughs> right? And you have this new medium. And what, what's, what are properties that are possible in this new medium? And those include things like, well, everyone is a participant. Everyone has, can publish. Everyone has a voice. So how do these two things come together in a platform that will help people? And I was like, well, uh, this will deepen over time. But like, OK, I'll have an identity so that people can find me. I will connect with the people that I'm allied with so we can help each other. So those are the two confluence. And then the experience of having been an entrepreneur um, you know, with uh, SocialLand and PayPal was like, well, what you do is you've got that. And then you figure out the smallest possible thing <laughs> that you can build and start iterating towards that. And so um, that's how LinkedIn is a platform for how every individual professional you know, kind of manages their work life. Uh, that's how the idea started. Hopefully, we're even becoming relevant this year. Uh, but whatever year it is, we will be. Uh, and the reason is because the same patterns of, of having an identity, connecting to the people you trust, and being able to navigate the world of work, that same pattern is true everywhere. For me, I expect the answer will still be that I am helping build and design human ecosystems through technology, finance, and entrepreneurship, and doing it both on the for-profit, non-profit side, with LinkedIn being a heavy component of that in terms of how we all present and, and act as how our, our business lives, how we take control of our business identity and our economic destiny as kind of business as one, but also as an investor at Greylock in terms of you know, investing in cool new companies. Uh, and also uh, working on Kiva and Endeavor. And, I, and it's not just those organizations, because presumably in a decade, some of the organizations will morph, uh, some, there'll be new ones, etc. But I would presume that it's more of those things, and hopefully, uh, hopefully I get better year by year what I do.